Uh, I will put this at the beginning of the medium uh, uh, collectibles. Uh, I just realized I was basing everything off this one, which had 11 ventures. Uh, so, ignore me when I say 11 ventures because, like, Shady Oaks only has seven ventures and, like, uh, this only has five. Each one has a random number. I didn't know that. I just based everything off, oh, this all has 11. So, if we do get to a collectible that is a venture, uh, it can have any type of, any amount of missions, but you will have to complete all missions through it, uh, to get the item. So, just a heads up. I'll try fix that in the, uh, I will t start saying that in the small one, and I'll fix that when we do all collectibles. Um, so, otherwise, uh, just real quick, that's what I want to say. Um, so yeah, each venture has its own amount of missions. Hello YouTube, we're going to be starting the large collectibles within Saints Row 2022. Um, so, some of these uh, in this selection you will either be give, given by complete a uh, uh, venture or a mission or I, I'll state when we get to it or it's you'll get for a DLC once you get the DLCs uh, since there's no DLCs out yet we don't get them and they're not tracked to the achievements uh, so the first one is the Atlas statue I believe we're right next to it because I just did a video on this area. Uh, but the Atlas statue is in the middle of the map. I was here showing off the discoveries. But it's on Lake Sebastian. And it's like right here. Um, so you have a helicopter. I'm probably going to be using a helicopter to get to all these, but I'll see you guys when we're close. I say close, but I knew I was, like, not too far from this thing. It is right here. Um... Like I show you on the map one more time, it's like right here. Uh, otherwise, we'll be on to the second of the large collectibles. Like I said, this will be a video for all of them. Is Cactus Cowboy. This one. Oh. Cactus Cowboy, I'm looking. It's like six southeast of this. I've been marked on a map. I'm just looking real quick. There it is. So this is located down here. When we get close, I will show you again the map and where it is. Okay, we got in close. I was a little bit off. I didn't look the right way. It's about right here. Right here, sorry. Can't use a camera in the helicopter, so we'll have to land. This has good home energy. Uh, otherwise, that was Cactus Cowboy. Up next is the Captain Eagle statue. Which is over here. There's a lot of collectibles, so I have these written down in certain places, but it's over here. So this is going to take a while. I'll see you when we get close. Okay, we've gotten close enough. It's not too far off from my marker. It is right here in the bottom right hand corner of the map. Why is this the Captain Eagle statue? The next large collectible is the Deviled Egg. So this is one of the collectibles that I was mentioned. Uh, 
you'll get this deal you'll get this when you buy the DLC this doesn't count towards the achievement uh, since the DLC isn't out yet can't really buy it I have the season pass so uh, once the DLCs are out we'll probably just unlock these for free as far as I was looking into it uh, up next is the giant golf ball which is located up here uh, so that'll take a little bit but I will be there soon enough okay we're getting close now and I can actually see it I haven't been up here yet I've been close by but this is the giant golf ball. I'm guessing there's probably collectibles and stuff to do up here. Uh, but it is right here. We'll take a photo. Giant golf ball. Otherwise, the next large collectible is the grizzly bear. Which is located second which is located it's not too far from here but it's located somewhere around here when we get close I will show it off okay so it's a little far off uh, there is another large one here so I am like right here. There is another large one here, the metal vulture, but I will uh, come back for it for when we go for it. But the grizzly bear is right here. I'm digging this. Otherwise, the next collectible, the large collectible, is the ice cream statue, which is located. Okay. That is located up here. Uh, I will be, when I get close, I will show you. We've gotten close enough. I'm more than certain it's the right here. The Marin and East. It's actually a clothing shop. Oh, God. Ooh. That could have been bad. I would have really fucked up if I got cops. I'm guessing it's actually this right here. <laughs> no, uh, it's right in front of the giant ice cream uh, cone. The ice cream statue. What a great buy. You would think it would be the giant one, but it's not. <laughs> okay, uh, up next is the Jim Rob statue. Um, if you're curious, it's for uh, doing all 11 Jim Rob ventures. We have to grab the cars and bring it back to Jim Rob. I just recorded a video of me doing all 11 in about 40 minutes. It was super quick. Uh, after I figured it out, I could do a trick to do most of them. Um, I will probably show that video off later. Uh, I did call it part six or part seven when I was recording, but I'll probably just show that off in a separate video where how I did it and uh, how you can use it to your advantage. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that is for completing all of, uh, venture the the uh, the ventures for Jim Rob. Uh, the next one is another venture. <laughs> The Karts Radio Tower is for doing all the radio station ventures. Um, same thing, place it down the map, do all the ventures, you unlock this reward. But up next is one that we can actually go and grab. Which is the liquor bottle. Which... Look at my map. Which is not too far. At least it's not across the map. A liquor bottle is down here. 
probably like right here. It's somewhere in this mess of junction. Uh, when we get close, I will show off where it is. Okay. We've gotten to the junction. It is... It's like right in the middle here. In, in the middle of this mess. It's on a roof. Um... We can see it right here. I want this in the crib. Otherwise, the next, uh, the next, uh, large collector, uh, the next large collectible is another DLC. Once the DLC comes out, if you buy the DLC, you unlock it. Same thing. This doesn't count for the achievement for all collectibles. Um, otherwise, on to the next one. The next one is the Metal Coyote. It is not far, so I'll show you where it is, and I will show you when we get close. But otherwise, it is, it is over here. This is probably one that I've seen probably four or five times. Because I've mapped out the area for all the discoveries. I just haven't done a video on that area yet. But I have all the discoveries shown on the map for me. So when we get close, I'll show you. Okay. We've gotten close to it. There is a clothing shop right over here. Uh, it, it is right in front. Uh, there is a shooting gallery over here. Keep shooting the missiles but uh let's grab the the twin oh i don't want to grab the twin uh coyote flash travel i just want to grab the coyote because uh i want to do that for my collectibles video And there is the Metal Coyote. But, uh, you can take picture of the front if you want for the fast travel. But I'm coming back for collectibles. And I want to keep that in the collectibles. Because once I take a picture of it, it won't pop up again. So, <laughs> uh, otherwise that was the Metal Coyote. Um, up next. Is the Metal Rabbit. Which is located over in El Dorado. Which is over here. Otherwise, when we get close, I will show you the next one. Okay, we've actually gotten close. This was, was a hard one to find. I thought this was going to be one of the hard, harder ones to find. I'm going to park over here. Uh, I'll show you on the map again where we are. We're right here. Otherwise, that was the Metal Rabbit. The next one is the Metal Vulture. Uh, this is the one that I sh uh, was next to the uh, the Grizzly Bear earlier. Uh, but I said I would save until we got to it. So the Metal Vulture, that was right around here. You only have to look at a description for that one, where that one's located. I know exactly where that was because we just went past it. So, uh, we're heading to this one. I'll see you when we get close. Okay, we are getting close again. Because, like I said, this is one of the ones I do know where it is. I'll show you in the map where it is. Again, uh, it is right here. Otherwise, that's the metal vulture. Metal vulture. We'll be on to our next large collectible, which is the novelty cowboy hat, which is located. 
damn it, civilian. Novelty cow. God damn it. Uh, Novelty cowboy hat is located about right here. Within this region. Like I said, when I get close by, I'll show you. Oh, there it is. Uh, we are here for the wall. One of the wall collectibles. I saw this and made note. Uh, we are like right here. Otherwise, the next collectible is a mission reward. So this is one of the ones I was talking about earlier. The oversized boot is a reward for a main mission. I will call out, I believe I have it on a different tab here. Because I have not hit that main mission yet. Uh, uh, it doesn't tell me. I, I thought this uh, other uh, other place told me. But yeah, you get this for completing a main, main mission. Uh, up next is the Owl Windmill. Which is not far from here, actually. It's on this side of the map. It's just down south. It's down and it's down somewhere it's right down here. When we get close, I will... Uh, I'll, uh, show you where it is. Okay. We're getting close. I'm guessing it's that purple thing glowing right now. <laughs> yes, it's a windmill. So, uh, was a little south of the... So, about right here on the map. Badland South. Otherwise, the next collectible is the Saints Discordia, which uh, you'll get this for completing the Saints uh, Skyscraper mission. Um, don't know what mission that is. It's probably just farther than the game. I'm still early game here. So you get this one for doing the Saint Skyscraper mission. Other than that, everyone from this point forward is ones that you find on the map. Up next is the Thunder Pump sign. This is across the map, so this will take me a little bit. But the Thunder Pump sign is all the way over here. I will see you guys when we get close. Okay. I was looking for it before actually saying anything. Uh, we are right here on the map. Bottom right hand corner. The Thunder Pump sign. Up next for large collectibles is the Tirepeed. Tirepeed? Which is which is over here, over there, somewhere. I I will show you when we get close. I'm actually having fun doing this because I'd rather get these all done so I don't have to worry about them. And also, it's probably a better video to put out right now instead of discoveries. Because probably a lot more people want to know where these are right now. Okay. I was a little far off on my mark. I'll show you where we are. We are about right here. It's not up here. It's about right here. The map. Um, I'm more than certain we might talk to an NPC early on in the game. Right next to this thing. What a view. Otherwise... The next collectible, the next large collectible, is the Tyceras the Tyceratops skull. That word is a mouthful. I'm bad with goddamn English. 
usually am with words. Ty Ticeratops skull, whatever. Um, it is right here. I will see you when we get close. I was a little off again. <laughs> Who ever suspected a thing of me being off a few times? It always happens. It's, it's just a natural thing. I'm not 100% correct all the time. Otherwise, uh, we are right here. Uh, otherwise, the... Triceratops skull is right there. Up next is the second to final large... Collectible. The Western Chuck Wagon. I actually know where this is because a wall collectible is in the same area. The Western Chuck Wagon is up here in the corner. You have to come up here for a uh, wall collectible. I think it's the Bearskin Rug, if I remember correctly. Okay, we, we are getting close. This one, there is fog right now. But this one we should see a lot sooner because it's, yeah, it's right there. It's, it's right, right here. Let me look on the map. Oh, sorry. I was, it's, yeah, it's like right, where am I on the map? Right here. It's within this area. Once you get close, it's a wagon right next to one of the shops. I'm not trying to destroy any targets because I need to come back for, here for collectibles later on. But, like I said, right there. This is a must have. Otherwise, we have one last large collectible to go get, which is the windmill. Which is not far from here. Good to know. Um... I will say, when we're heading down to this lot as large collectible, I really hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, I believe this is part of the golf course, actually. Um, or part of the theme land, whatever it's called. Uh, I will say, the next one we will probably do will be medium, but it will be the longest of all the collectibles. Because there's like 47 collectibles. Um, there are only like 20 of the small so the medium is going to be the longest. It might take a, a day more uh, to come out than the rest. I don't know yet. Uh, all depends on how much I record today. Um, but I really do hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, we'll do medium collectibles next and then small collectibles. And then once they're all out, I'm going to give it a few days and then I'll put a video with all collectibles. Small, medium, large, and wall. put a video combined with all of them I will have timestamps everything it'll just take some time so just give me the benefit of doubt for that otherwise we should be getting close I don't think I have to cut out anything there since I'm talking to you guys I actually put the marker really close yeah so you ha you have to go near this area for one of the vehicle pickups for rim job uh, JR a Jim Jim Robs yeah, so we're about right here on the map. The last collectible is right here. This will make a Otherwise, oh. that is all large collectibles. All large collectibles, uh in saints row 2022 um like i said some of them are for mission rewards or dlcs that will come out later in the future um otherwise uh i hope you guys did enjoy the video if you guys like the video if you like it. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel recommend subscribing to the channel to keep up with all content otherwise this has been mr again sign off have a good morning have a good afternoon have a good night wherever you are just have a good day hopefully i see you guys in the next video and peace